try to ask you to, to stick by. I know sometimes that can be a challenge. Um, but in order to help you with that, um, you'll notice in front of you when you're speaking a lighting system. Green will indicate you've got time left. When it gets to yellow, one minute. Red means your five minutes are up. So if you get to the red, I hope you'll please try to go ahead and wrap up your comments. Um, I'd like to start by, again, thanking everyone for taking the effort to be with us and, and make the trip to be here today. And I'd like to introduce uh, first Ms. Cynthia Lee, who is the Associate Director of the Langley Research Center for NASA. Ms. Lee oversees the operations of the center and serves as Senior Advisor to the, Central direct, to the Center's Director. Langley was founded in 1917 and is the nation's first civilian aeronautical research facility and NASA's oldest field center. Ms. Lee, thank you for being with us today. We're looking forward to uh, hearing your comments. Good afternoon. I am Cindy Lee, the Associate Director at NASA Langley Research Center, located in Hampton, Virginia. Thank you for the opportunity to testify before the subcommittee regarding the significant role of high-tech small businesses in the research being performed at NASA Langley. As you know, Langley is one of Na 10 NASA centers and one of two facilities located in Virginia. NASA Langley provides a critical agency role through a diverse portfolio of work in aeronautics, exploration, science, space operations, and education. We are helping to transform the nation's air transportation system to ensure safer, environmentally friendly, and efficient air travel. We're contributing to the science that will enable a better understanding of our home planet, and we're helping develop the vehicles to support future human space activities. There are currently about 3,700 employees at Langley, approximately half of whom are private sector contractors working on or near site. Of these private sector employees, over one-third are employed by small businesses. During 2008, NASA Langley made a total of nearly 900 awards to small businesses and obligated in excess of $150 million on both new and existing small business contracts for services ranging from commodities to research. Today I'm going to highlight three examples of small businesses providing high-tech, cutting-edge research to Langley. Science Systems and Applications Incorporated, or SSAI, is a minority, woman-owned business of nearly 550 employees that is playing a critical role in science research and technology development. They contribute heavily to the Atmospheric Science Data Center that's located at Langley. This data center is one of the premier national repositories of atmospheric data important to understanding global climate change. Their efforts in data archiving and processing have resulted in major system performance improvements while significantly reducing cost. SSAI has continually shown a dedication to supporting the NASA mission and has recognized the importance of attracting and retaining specialized expertise for Langley. In addition to their technical excellence, they provide outstanding services to the community and to their employees through training and their scholarship programs. SSAI was recently selected as Langley's 2009 Small Business Prime Contractor of the Year. Analytical Services and Materials, or ASM, is a minority women owned business of approximately 130 employees. For many years, they have provided analytical and experimental services that have contributed to NASA missions, the NASA mission success across high visibility aeronautics and space exploration programs. ASM employees are part of a formidable team that have delivered thousands of computational solutions to the Constellation program. Acting upon recommendations of the Columbia Accident Investigation Board, ASM employees provided key analyses leading to corrective actions for improved shuttle safety. Responding to a 911 call from the National Transportation Safety Board, NASA brought ASM experts in to help us analyze aircraft structural failures associated with airline accidents. Their work has been recognized with numerous awards, including the NASA Engineering and Safety Engineering Excellence Award and the 2006 Small Business Administration National Prime Contractor of the Year. Analytical Mechanics Associates, or AMA, is a small business of nearly 90 employees who deliver critical support to NASA's exploration, science, and aeronautics programs. Their high-caliber team has provided key support to NASA's Constellation Program, including analysis of human lunar, lunar architecture concepts, the Ares launch vehicles, and the Orion crew module landing system. 
AMA has provided critical support to NASA's science missions to Mars, including modeling and simulation for entry, descent, and landing. They also supported the, re the recent inflatable reentry vehicle experiment flight demonstration at Wallops Island. AMA was nominated this year for NASA's prestigious George M. Lowe Award in the Small Business Services category. Small businesses are important to Langley because they are innovative, cutting-edge, agile, responsive, and provide technical excellence. Because Langley realizes the value of this community, we're heavily engaged in outreach activities for small businesses. In 2009, we communicated with small businesses over 5,000 times. We also have a Small Business Administration Procurement Center representative on site. NASA Langley has spent approximately one-third of our procurement budget for small businesses for the last 12 years, and we exceeded our small business goals for the past nine years. Again, I'd like to thank you for the opportunity to appear before the subcommittee today, and I look forward to addressing your questions. Thank you very much, Ms. Lee. I'd like to now recognize Mr. Bruce Underwood, the technical manager of Wallop Space Flight Facility for NASA. Wallop Space Flight Facility